We just roll it, bring it live. We live? We, we are. Happy Halloween, folks. We're live. This is Ghost Dimension. I have an Obulus. I have a REM pod. And Sean has some other equipment, which I'm going to set up, and Sean can show you what he's got. I've got a few of these. Hello. I've got some new hair as well. I've got some of these REM pod devices. And uh, we are in the um, the Wellington Hotel, one of the most haunted places that we've ever been to. And here's an old funky wardrobe. And I'm just going to put these rims down a second. So you're going to have to bear with me two seconds because I can't see right, what I'm doing. Because I can film you and I can... Oh, let me right. put the ovulus down. There we go. Right, stick so a Sean, rim somewhere else. Well, I'll stick stuck one over there. Maybe stuck one. Right at the end of the computer table, so. I'm going to stick one by this spooky wardrobe. Okay. Spooky wardrobe. Yep, yeah, spooky wardrobe that opens um, on its own. I think my hat's still on my head. Um, really? Okay, the REM pod's gone off. We weren't even near it. It really did just go Right, off. let me just go and reset that. Right, resetting the REM pod and moving away. Right, okay, so there's Getting another on. one over there. So Sean's this Halloween is, regalia. Well, this, I thought I saw somebody at the back then, like a female. Did you hear that? I did hear that. Could do. Oh, my hat's gone, yeah. Yeah. So, that back his hat's gone. It's all going Pete Tong in here tonight. We might ditch the hat. Ditch the hat. See, this is what you don't see when we film, isn't it? This Halloween. is what you see on a live. Everything going on. So, my see hat's it. probably going to fall off. The place is probably going to fall off. We've got loads of stuff out here. We have. It's, this room's haunted. Um, there's been apparitions, there's been shadow figures yeah. we've missed in here, knocks and bangs knocks and, and noises. Bangs. Yeah, the usual suspect when you come to a haunted pub. Um, um, but it's been fabulous. You know, we've been here since the day and already things were happening. As soon as we um, came in to this pub, things were going on. And it wasn't just knocks and bangs, it was big things as well. Fantastic. So, who knows what we're going to get well, tonight. Well, it's Halloween. It is Halloween. Witchy poos are out and so are we, because we are now witches and wizards. Full regalia uh, uh, um, for your entertainment. Yes, we make ourselves look silly. That's for Halloween, isn't it? And, and you know what? It might actually get the spirits to come out and join us and interact with the investigation a bit more because we're a bit silly and we've got some spooky stuff going on. So yes. you know. I'm going to go and get me Ovulus. Get your Ovulus. Would you like um, a fork? Look, there's loads of them here. Forks everywhere. He thinks it's a comedian, no comedian. <laughs> right, um, I think we should start up here and work our way towards this wardrobe. <coughs> what do you reckon? The Ovilus. Yeah, the Ovilus is really quiet. I, I like this piece of equipment because it's, it's not usually quiet for me, but it is. Maybe it's all about to kick off. Who knows? Yeah. Is anybody here? Can you come towards us? I'm going to turn this down a bit, the IR and lights. <coughs> I heard that. Did Hello? you Did you get that? Yeah. I heard it, yeah. Over there. Can you do another noise for us? If that was you that just made a big bang in this room, can you make another noise for us? Do you know what I can smell? What? Fire. I smell fire. Fire? Mm -hmm. Did you hear that? Help. Yeah, like a voice. -y. Yeah, help. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Were you burnt in a fire or did, was this place involved in a fire? <gasps> Another Where is that coming from? I don't know. That's weird. It's not this board. Because no. it's over here. Can you speak to us? Tell us who you are. Maybe come towards Bex and 
speak to this de- uh, interact with this device which will you can maybe manipulate the words inside of its machine no way it's behind us now yeah it's like it's playing a game because we're dressed like this it's it- sensed it whoever it is no disrespect by calling it it but uh, he she spirit sense the fact that we're dressed up as you know funny and maybe messing around with us possibly yeah, yeah that's because now the clicking is coming from over there where before it was coming from over here yeah by these computers yeah but but for peace of mind here we go again yeah bear in mind everybody these computers have not been on today so it's not anything it's not cooling down anyway. or anything like that. It's just not been on. Shall I go and stand over here so if I feel anything? Yeah, stand by the door. Can you affect me? Can you affect my meter? Can you affect this meter on the floor? It's got a big shiny aerial. If you touch it, it'll go off. Can you touch Sean? So? So? You saw us? You saw us before? You see us downstairs? Can you hear that? Talking? Mm hmm. I can mumble him. Yeah. yeah. We shouldn't be getting anything Is up that there. you? No, we shouldn't. Can you affect this meter again? Walk towards us and say something. We're going to walk down this room until we feel you. If we don't feel you, we'll go somewhere else, won't we? We will. Did you hear that? Yeah. Did you hear that? Yeah, 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 yeah. What was that noise? I don't know. There's lots of weird creaky noises in here at the minute. And some of them are getting a bit weird. Are you here with us? Is anybody with us? Is anybody able to communicate with us? We're going to go and sit. It's yeah. over here, isn't it? What was she saying, Vex? Let's sit on these chairs for a second. Can you sit over on another? Yeah. Okay. Can you affect this? I asked you before and you did it, which I appreciate. Can you do it again? Is anybody with us? Is that you? That was on that board. I really hope that the camera can pick this up audibly. Yeah, I do. I really hope that they're loud enough, because they're really loud to us. There's a thud on the floor as well. Stall. Yes, yeah. this is part storeroom. As you can see, there's a load of things in here. Yeah, they store things in here. Can you um, affect us more? Communicate with us more. Maybe tap again on that board. Tap on that board, please. I heard that. Yeah, that was down there. Did you just tap down there by the Christmas trees? Can you communicate back to me via my ovulus, via the device in my hand? We can communicate back and forth with you via this. We are here not to harm or play any disrespect to anybody. 
We're here to communicate with you. I can't spin this chair to you. I'll push you. Wee! Wee! The two witches. The two witches. Wee! Wow, look what's going on. Look right where I let me stop. Come here. Right. Uh, look, look at her. The maniac. Girl's not right, man. She's not normal. So maybe that maybe that stirred the energy up in here. Sorry. It's alright, mate. The alter ego coming count. Deirdre, Get like it. that around 31st of October. August, October. Yeah, same thing. Yes. Just maybe then, maybe um, that would have stirred. Oh, your logs. I know, our hats are becoming uh, somewhat cumbersome. And my new hair is getting a bit itchy. Itchy, mine was. Mm, it smells and my a lot. Ma my mask was a little bit... Mm. Hi. So, anybody that's with us, that's joined us, that's been making those noises, let's hear your voice audibly. Let's hear what you've got to say. Yeah, top and then top. It's that board, isn't it? It is, it is that board, and you know what's on there? What? It's, this is the brewer's, so 95% of 20 pints yeah. gets you an extra pint as a brewer. And then there's the other part of it. Crazy. Mmm, how to make extra money. As a brewer. Is anybody with us? Can you tap on that board for us? Tell us by are you female? Tap twice if you're female. Tap once if you're male. Oh that was once. It's a male. Can you do it again? Can you tell us your name? A lot of spirits like to use this device to tell their, to tell us their name. You can hear voices. Okay. Yeah. God, we've got loads of equipment in here and they're not using it yet. No. Mm. Knocks and bangs. Voices, but not really using this. Or no, shall we go down there? Yeah. Well, let's go down that way and see if anything changes. Look, my eyes just in my eyes. Okay. Now we're stood at the back end of this room. You're a male, we know that, because you're noiseless in the tap, you made it. Oh, whoa, 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 it's running down there then. Oh, sorry, yeah. Yeah, 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 a ding and then a run. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Turn, turn it quickly with these hats on. Nightmare, oh, isn't it? Maybe take the hat off. Did you pass here? Did you die here? Can you show yourself in light form on camera? See that flashing light yeah, on my did, computer yeah. over there? What's that? Is it a sticker? Is it a sticker? I think so. That might be bouncing up high out of here. Mm -hmm. Did you hear that? I did hear that. Dum, dum. Should we go and see? Go and have a look. Hello? Ooh. Hello? Oh, 
very, very strange. It's like we're being fooled. So we go down there, and they're up here, and then we come up here, they're down there. Hmm. It's really, really weird, really weird, isn't it? Playing games with us. This is not gonna happen. I'm gonna lay it down. I'm gonna put it down. I'm gonna put my seat. And see if anybody, uh, um, Maybe they can spin that chair. Let's have a look. Stand back. Hey. No. No, no, when your chair's spinning because we just touched it. But spin it the other way. Spin it towards... What's that say? Think. Think. Now spin the chair towards us. Move the chair. Come on, come towards us. Come on, you know you can do it. You know you want to do it. If you have enough energy to affect doors, you can do the chair. That's the rem, that's the rem. Okay, rem's going off. Thank you. See? You asked for the chair, the rem goes off. It's like a, a game that they play. cat and mouse, isn't it? Yeah, it is cat and mouse, yeah. Thank you. The stairs, those ladders, the state sounds like that was just a tap on those. That's just then. What was that? You just said something. That was a bear. Shock. There you go. Shock. However, there you go. We want to be more shocked. We want something to happen. We want the doors to open. <coughs> Did you just knock these? What's that? Hmm? There's a noise on that. Like scratching. I didn't hear it, I missed it. Let's do it. Ask for it again. Can you scratch this again? Make a noise on this um, wardrobe? Do you hear that? Tap tap. Tap tap. Tap tap down here somewhere. Oh, I feel sick. I feel sick. I really do. Not good. Not good. No, I feel really sick. Do you know that? Yeah, 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 yeah. Can you affect my meter again? Shock. Are we going to be in shock? Are you building up for us to be in shock? Maybe we should uh, split off and do two loans. Reckon? Yeah. See if anything happens while we're on our own. Okay. Yeah. Let's go off yeah. and, and split off. Let's go down. I don't know. Let's uh, let's go off. And sort it. Let's go off and think. Okay, guys, well, well, we'll we'll go to uh, some credits holding screen, and we'll we'll go off and find some, somewhere to go. on that chair and I didn't get a chance to catch it but it was going off so hopefully it will go off again but also we've got the SLS here so I'll have to see if uh, I would love to capture a figure sat on that chair and the REM going off at the same time that would be really quite impressive Is there anybody in here with me? Anybody near that chair? This chair is supposed to have uh, just strangely appeared from nowhere. He and the landlord said that uh, he checked this, checks this fire escape quite regularly. Oh, hello. There is a figure. 
Are you the person that's moved this chair? You is one tall bugger. Can you do something to move that chair for me now? I'm gone. Are you near this chair? That was pretty good. Can you come and show yourself again to me, please? Are you on that chair? And you make that device light up if you're near it. Just touch that metal aerial, that metal rod. Or show yourself on the chair if you could. Anybody there? Let's try and see if uh, there's anybody else that might want to map in and be seen. Really quite uh, cold down here. That's a pretty great big spider over there, thankfully. I think it's dead. That looks like a very old gas lamp. Yeah, that's an old gas lamp. Wow, that's impressive. <clears throat> Can you come and sit on that chair for me, please? Just like to see you. If you'd like to move it, that's fine, that'd be good. Just try and give us some sort of a sign that you're here. Touch that metal aerial. I'm sure you were sat on that seat a moment ago. It's the annoying thing, I set that rem up. But I couldn't get the camera on quick enough to record. And unfortunately I didn't catch it as it was being set off. and set that device off that's on the chair. If that was you before, do it again for me please. Let's try to flip the screen round. So, <clears throat> not that you want to see my ugly mug. But let's see if I can get both in. Can you come and set it off again? Can come and sit down on the chair? If I just mapped you a moment ago, if I had you on this screen, show yourself again to me, please. Try as hard as you can. Really very, very cold in here. But to be honest, you'd expect nothing different because that door there leads straight outside. Spider, glad it's dead. Do not like spiders as you might already know. Come and show yourself on that chair, please. Come and sit, sit down, come and have a seat. Set that off for me. That's weird. You can see that's, that was juddering all over the place then. It's not done that before.
So apart from the bit that I didn't capture on the rem, it's a bit quiet. Just a bit gutted, I couldn't capture it quickly enough. Really, really want to capture somebody at this chair. That would very much make my night. Can you move that chair? Can you sit on it? Can you make that device that's on it light up? Pretty sure you were doing it just now. I'd like you to do it again if you can. The figure that was stood here a moment ago, did you have anything to do with that chair? There. Well, what have you been doing there? So that looked like it came off the chair and was trying to go up the stairs. And it's stuck for some reason. What's the matter with you? That's weird. Oh, now it's gone. Where did you go? Can you come back? What is it about this chair that you like? Why have you brought it down here? What's the purpose of it being here? Is there anything else that you can do? I'd like to see you, but if you can make a noise, that'll be a good start. If you can set that device off that's on the chair, if you don't like it being on the chair, let me know, touch the, the metal rod. Pretty good figure, I'm hoping that I got it on the camera properly. <coughs> Unfortunately I'm having technical problems with this at the moment, finding it hard to make it record so having to do it off the camera. It's not ideal but at least it's doing the job. Come and sit on that chair again for me. And show yourself on it, please. Ooh. Okay. Just taking a step back because I just felt something on the top of my head. I don't think it was that because it really... It's not even moving, I think, if I bumped into that. And now the REM has reset itself. Oh! Now that's weird. That right now is showing that it's a drained battery. However, just before we started I put a new battery in it. And now it's reset itself. Okay, that was weird, something just blew down my ear. Okay, that was really good, thank you. If you've just reset that, done something with the battery, thank you. 
Who blew on my neck? Who blew on my ear? Come and show yourself. Okay, so I turn my back and it's done it again. Okay. So that is definitely showing that the battery is drained, but it still needs something to set that off to make it go through that motion. And it'll probably reset again. Which it doesn't normally do when it's on a dead battery. It'll just flash. Show yourself. Sit on that chair. And if you notice, twice I turned my back to it. Twice it went off. Very odd. Very odd. just had a figure there for a second and I missed it on the camera. Shit. Missed it. If that was you, show yourself again for me please. Please show yourself one more time. That's annoying. Thank you. Right, so. Mask of fate. Right, so, it's Halloween, guys. 31st of October, 2018. I got an obelisk that I'm going to switch on now. I've got a K2, and I got a couple of REMs dotted around the place. I'm in. One minute, guys. I'm in the Wellington um, Hotel, and it's fabulous. It's really active, and I'm going to do a little invest for you for Halloween. Um, right now, I'm currently in the function room. I can't see a damn thing, so I'm going to put you on the side like this. <gasps> Did you hear that? Right, that was, uh, you can't see me, so I'm going to pick you back up. Um, let me go, just go, that was the ovulus. The ovulus went off. So I'm just going to go and see what it said and who's trying to communicate with me. <clears throat> Enough. Enough. Well, we've been here a long, long time investigating. So maybe, yeah, the spirits have had enough. I'm going to take that with me, actually, just in case it goes off again. So, uh, have you had enough, spirits? Have you had enough of, um, of us trying to communicate with you? I get that. Thank you. There was just a bang. I'm going to turn you round so you can see everything else that I can see. So as you can see, it's really, really big. Oh, wow. Can you do that again? Can you bang like that? Thank you very much. Massive bang then. Oh, I just had the fry of my life. It's, uh, 
It's that. I just saw it in the dark. And I, saw, I thought, well, who's that? So I'm a, I'm a paranormal investigator. My name is Bex. And I'm here to see if you really do exist. If spirits really do exist. That was my, my obvious. Lesser. Mm. What could that mean? Is anyone here? Okay, there's a massive bang over here. It didn't affect my, my REM pod. I have a REM pod here and a REM pod on the stage. Can you come and speak to me? Come and tell me your name. Another bang up. That's fantastic. Video, did I just say? Video. Seriously? Oh, God. Video, and then the REM pod went off. Wow. Okay. Can you do something else? That's really got me scared now. The massive bang. And then that happened. I'm just going to go over to our equipment. Oh my God, it's so cold. It really is so, so cold in here. I don't know how I'm going to stick this one out. That was terrifying. The REM just went... I wish I had a walkie-talkie to ask somebody to come up with me now. So you're in here with me. Can you touch the REM pods to do that again? You make something else go off? Oh, no. That door sounds like it wants to open. I don't want to go over there. Why did I take it so far? Okay, I'm coming to see this. Can, can you make the REM pods go off again? Somebody over there. Oh, I don't know where to go because there's stuff going on over there. And then there's stuff going on by the bar. This says greater. Do you think you're a greatest, greater presence than me? Is that what you're saying? Oh, God. There's like an... Oh. Oh! Oh, that's nice. That really is nice. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, you know, if you never see it. It says friend. So you're friendly. Your friendly spirit. That's nice. I feel a little bit better now, to be honest. I really do. I'm friendly and I'm not here to harm you whatsoever. I literally just want to see if you exist. Um, you did scare me with those REM pods. I'm not going to lie. But then if you appeared to me, I would uh, I'd run because I'm... Um, a scaredy cat. <clears throat> um, I'm doing this for Halloween, so I don't know when you passed. Uh, I don't know if you ever celebrated Halloween, but I like Halloween, and we're celebrating Halloween, doing a, a bit of a film, a bit of a, a, a camera footage, to see if we can actually capture any spirits that exist. I'm going to spin you around so you can see what I can see and let's hope the REM pods go off again. Can you do that again? Can you affect my meters? Affect the REM pods? Can 
Can you affect the one on the stage? Or can you open that door? Pardon? Can you open the door? Or do something with the glasses? Chair. There is so many chairs. <gasps> Did, can you move a chair? I've got an exam. I've got a, a, a bit of an experiment I want to try. Oh. I'm going to put a chair right in the middle of the floor and I'm going to see if it moves. Okay, so let's, what's that say? Wow, this is wave. Are you going to wave to me or are you going to wave at my equipment so it goes off? There you go. There's your chair. There's your chair, right in the middle of the floor. Are you going to wave to me? Okay, there was a, a knock over there. Can you, if you're by the the um, the stage, can you make that REM pod go off? What was that? What was that? What was that? Hello, can you do that again? Something just went off. Hello? Can you do that again for me? Can you wave your hand over the equipment? Can you do something? Can you say your name? I'm Bex and I'm not here to harm you. There was a noise over there. Can you affect the REM pod on the stage or on the chair by uh, the table by the chair? You've asked me put to put the chair there. There's another knock. I'll tell you what, for Halloween, this is terrifying me. I'm only here to, to seek out some answers. This is so active, this room. It truly is. Can you tell me your name? Are you a female? Oh, there was a noise down there. So you're female. Knock once. Knock once. It's a female. There's a knock down there. Are you happy? Knock once for yes. Twice for no. Oh, it just knocked once. She's happy. Oh. Two. She's not happy. Three. Can you knock out how many spirits there is here in this room? I'm just going to turn this light off so you can see. One. Only one spirit. Seriously? And you know what's funny? My ovulus has gone quiet. The last thing it said was wave. Did you wave goodbye? Or do you want me to wave? Do you want me to leave? Leave you in peace? I think 
I think I need to leave. So I'm going to wave goodbye. <laughs> bubble, bubble, toil and trouble. <laughs> so, my pretties, I have come back from the dead for your souls. <laughs> Meanwhile, back at the Wellington Hotel, this is the Halloween ghost hunt and we are looking for ghosties and a good barber because my hair is a little bit messy. Is there anybody or any bodies in this room with me now? Please come and laugh at my outfit. Can you move a chair? Can you knock on the wardrobe? Can you do anything at all to let me know you are here? Can you knock? Somewhere, on something, at something. Okay, can't see a pretty thing. That sounded like something just hit the floor. I can't see a damn thing. So, what shoes? Okay, something on the floor. Can't get down there to have a look, so I'm not sure what it is. But thank you if that was you. Can you do something else? Can you switch the lights on? Make a noise for me. Move a chair. There's lots of chairs on wheels. Can you move one of the chairs that's on the wheels? What can you do for me, please? Anything at all? Can you knock on something? Knock on this for me. And you're not back. Can you not back from there, please? Is there anybody in there? Anybody that's attached to this? Did you throw something before? Can you throw something again? Throw something else or tap or knock or bang? Absolutely anything that you can do I'll be appreciative. There's lots of uh, things you can knock in here. There's glasses. Can you perhaps make make them chink, make them move? Sorry the glasses are there, I'm just having a look. 
Can you do something with one of those? Can't see a damn thing out of this wig. Ooh. Oh, I just heard something there right next to me. Cannot see Get anything out of this damn wig. I'll tell you. The things Mr. Reynolds has us do. I'm going to sit in a chair. Can you push that chair for me? Push me along the floor. I already feel myself moving with the gravity. Let's see if we can. See anybody behind us this way? It's a, it's a strange, strange place. Looks uh, just you know like any other building. It's very normal, very run of the mill. But there's uh, a definite feel to it. Especially when it gets darker. Can you do something for me? Anything at all? Can you turn the lights on? It's been said that happens. Can you flick that light switch there for me, please? Can you pull a cracker? That'd be a good one. Some crackers there, can you pull one of those, make it go bang perhaps? And some more up there. Whatever you can do. I really appreciate it. Some more crackers there. So warm in this. Make a noise for me, please. Anything at all. Okay, I just bumped into the ladders because that door just uh, made a noise. I don't think I bumped into it. Pretty sure I didn't bump into that. I felt myself going to the ladders, but I think I'd have felt if I'd have bumped into that. Did you just knock on that or push the door or something? Can you do it again? Okay, I'm in the shop for a second. Can you do it again? Oh, do you know it's gone really cold around me right now? in this spot right now it feels really quite cold. In certain parts of the building that are very cold at this time of year but this room has been warm. Just this spot that I'm in right now doesn't feel ooh, ooh, ooh. now something just touched the back of my neck. Something just touched the back of my neck. I've got this bloody wig on but I just felt something sort of tickle the back of my neck. It's literally like a couple of fingers just scratched the back of my neck. Not scratched so much as just lightly touched. Thank you, if that was you. Same area near the wardrobe again. Same area. That was a laugh. 
Fuck over there. Do that again. Can you make that loud thud again for me? What's that? Just heard somebody in here say something. That was clearly a voice. What it said, I'll have to play that back and have a, a listen to it. That sounded like somebody was in here then. Are you talking to me? Can you say that again for me, please? It sounds like it's mumbling somewhere. Say that again, do that again. Can't breathe with this one. Tell you if I think if I went trick or treating tonight I'd end up on the oxygen. <coughs> or beaten up by people that thought I was out to mug them of their sweeties. Come and say something again. Come and do something for me, please. Anything at all? Oh, I've got a pain now. A pain in my chest. That's a weird feeling. I'm just taking a pew again. Oh, a little spin, see if we can see anybody over my shoulder. Doesn't look like it, does it? Oh, I've gone dizzy. Yeah, that was a weird pain that I got then. Oh, my. So, you think uh, I could cop off like this? Do you think I'm handsome? <clears throat> Will you take me home to meet your mother dressed like this? Pretty sure she'd kick me out. Probably call the police. Have you section? Weird place, weird, weird, weird. Somebody just touched my hand. Can you do it again? I felt like something touched the back of my hand. Could be wrong. Right, uh, in my imagination. In fact, no, it's not something that's touched my hand. It's that cobweb feeling that you get. Sure. 
many of you can identify with that, but uh, feeling like it's just very light, cold body. So a couple of times it's just felt like something brushed my hand. Now, it could be this. But my hand was over here. And I don't think this is long enough. No, it's up there, so... Not sure. Not too sure at all. That's enough for now. Everybody, um, I'm just in a room, they've put me in on my own, um, so I'm just going to call out see if anybody's with me. Is there anybody here with me? I've got a rem um, in the corner, just let me flip this round. I've got a rem there, if you can see it. Um, I've also got a voice recorder there, so I'm just going to do some calling out see if anybody is here with me. If anybody's here with me, I've got a voice recorder here to my left. Can you come and tell me your name? And I've also got a device on this table. It's a REM pod. If you touch the aerial, you'll set an alarm off. But if there's anybody here with me now, can you come and talk to me? I don't mean you no harm. Just come and tell me your name. My name is Jane. You'll probably see me around uh, behind the, the camera, but today I'm actually in front of the camera. Is there anybody here that wants to tell me your story? I'm willing to hear. Or come and touch the REM pod to let me know that you're here. Or knock on one of the walls. Or knock on the door. I just want to know your name. Please come forward, come and talk to me. I'm just going to take you for a walk down the corridor now, see if you can see anything. This is a corridor. Ladies toilets. Come on, come and talk to me. Come and tell me your name. Is that you behind me? Did you just make a noise? I'm just going to go a little bit forward because it's a bit freaky. Please come and tell me your name. Come and tell me your story.
just this one big place. Kind of eerie. I think this is a picture of what the place used to look like. I'm just going to show you now. I think this is back in its day. Into place. There's loads of rooms. Loads of rooms. Are you here with me? Because she's gone so cold. This room is so cold. Can you do something? Could you knock something over for me? Could you tap on the wall? Or tap on the door? Just to let me know that you're here. Oh, I've got shiver right down my spine. Just picking the voice recorder up. Are you here? Do I look strange in my uh, my outfit? It's Halloween. Yeah. Please come forward. I just turned the voice recorder off so. Have a listen to that when I finish filming. See if I can catch her name or anybody that's here with me. Come and touch the rampod that's in front of me. Come and set it off. There's an aerial. See? If you touch it, there you go. Can you do that? Hello? Somebody behind me. Hello? Hello? Come on, do something. Come make a noise. Come on, tap on one of these plates. Or move some of these boxes on the floor. I've lost my heart. Hold on a minute. Take my heart up. There you go. I 
if anybody's here, just knock on the door, knock on the wall, just do something. going to go through here into this room see if anything's happening here it's another room let's see if anything's happening in here Is anybody in here? Can you make a noise for me? Oh, my hair's in my face. Could you move one of these chairs that's in front of me? I bet you can't. Can you tap on one of the windows? <gasps> Excuse my language. What was that? Hello? Hello? forward come show yourself to me I've got this camera in my hand come and show yourself hardest not to trip over anything or knock anything so I'm walking with the camera banging come on come and do something do something big come and scare me because I don't scare very easily Give it your best shot. Come on, I'm waiting. Something big. There's plenty of glasses here. I'm sure you could throw one. 
if you really wanted to. Or drop one on the floor. Just walk past the wall and see my hat, my Halloween hat, and the reflection. I think my point's gone on top of my head. Can you do one last thing for me? Can you bang? Could you push me? I'm going to have to go in a minute. It would be nice if you could just do the one last thing. You're very quiet. I think I scare you more. You hiding away from me. This is a um, weird, weird place. This is the passage, as we've been calling it. Down these stairs is something very, very strange. If we can get down. You've got a rubber duck and a chair. And what the hell is that? I just stood in. Nothing. You've got these fly things catching flies and... <laughs> And a wacky door. And what's weird is that this chair apparently just manifested itself from upstairs down here on its own. That's the story behind it. It just came on its own and nobody put it there. Um, I don't know where the rubber duck come from, but I don't think the duck's paranormal. However, we're here. It's haunted. And we're going to call out and see if anybody... The, the light in here is caused by these emergency fire lights because this is now a fire escape. But let's see if anybody can communicate with us and speak to us. Just spotted that and it just distracted me. I'm so sorry. It's like an old gas lamp. How cool is that? It is, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to call out see if anybody's here. And hopefully, somebody may communicate with us. And then, oh my god, there's cobwebs everywhere. Oh, I hate spiders, man. I hate spiders. And then I'll meet Bex and Paul and then Jane and all that big group hug and shake the spiders off. Because I hate spiders. Okay. Right. Is there anybody here? that wants to communicate with me, that wants to move this stuff off this chair, or maybe you can make this chair disappear. Please come forward and join me. Do it and move the chair. Make it vanish. If you can use your voice to communicate with me, please use your voice. My name is Sean, I'm a paranormal investigator. I'm not here to offend anybody or to harm anybody. I'm just here looking at this chair in the hope that it may disappear. Which is a bit weird, but it came here by itself, so maybe it'll disappear. If it does disappear, I might run. 
Maybe you can move it if you made it manifest. Can you move the chair? Can you make a noise in here for me? Can you give me like a tapping noise, knocking noise? Please. I heard a noise then. And it's, it came from like upstairs, I think. Or on the walls. Can you do another, another noise for me? Or well, even use your voice. Is there anybody here? Maybe you walked down these stairs in the past and you, you fell and you hurt yourself. Maybe this place was your place to hide. Oh, okay, I heard the noise then. This was your place to hide, was it? Did you come here? I can see this was a part of a barn. This is a false wall here. So maybe you, you lived here? Do you have horses here? I'm just going to stay silent. Do you want to see me, Devil Tail? Oh, I don't even see it. Oh, devil tail. Oh, my hair's going. What are we looking at? There's my devil tail. Look, woo! No way, no way, no way. What the hell happened there then? The lights all just flickered. The lights just flickered. They, they just came on. Did, can you do that again? If that was you, just do it again. Was it that light or was it the oil light? If it was you, can you do it one more time? Oh, I had a big bang then. I'm going to come up these stairs. Love Halloween. All the witches come out and it's a bit more spooky than what it should all normally be. Okay. Is there anybody in the attic? Maybe you fell out of that attic down here. Maybe the chair came from up there and is now down here. Can you use your voice and communicate to me? <sighs> Hello? Lights flicker again. There's somebody. I am hearing noises. I'm telling you now, there's people down here. Show yourself to me. Manifest on this camera. Or up here on my camera. There's lots and lots of like little weird noises happening right now. And hair going in my mouth. Uh, yeah, it's, it's like that synthetic hair. And it goes in. Horrible. Anyway, there's, there's noises that are all around. And I'm not sure if they're on the stairs or if they're down here. That was right behind there. Not back. Not back. Come on.
sometimes I question if I'm hearing these things or happening, but no, that was a that was a big noise. Can you do it again? Can you hear me? Throw throw you know. Throw something at me. Throw that duck at me. Throw the duck. Are you still with me? Is anybody with me? I'm going to tap on this wall. Tap back if you're here. Thank you. I'm going to tap again. Tap again if you can. It's like hit and miss, hit and miss, hit and miss. Can you make a loud noise? I'm going to look at the duck, make the duck move. There's the duck. I've called him out. Make him move. I'm going to whistle, maybe you can whistle as well. to get these spirits to interact with you the way you want them to interact. But no, just know that I'm getting somewhere at the minute. Feel it. I'm a protection. Is anybody here now? Is anybody here? Did I just see and hear somebody come down the stairs there? Walk down the stairs and let us hear you. Come on. Let us all hear your footsteps. Don't be afraid. Don't be shy. Don't be afraid. I want something big to happen, you know? Something really scary, something really spooky. Oh, I don't know where the noise was an aeroplane. I thought it was like, ooh, it's an aeroplane going over. Is anybody with me still? You affected the lights in this room. Affect them again. Oh jeez. Oh, that wasn't a good idea, was it? That was a really bad idea. Just locked myself in the room. Look, that, if I pull that, that's supposed to open. It's a fire door, it's one bloody way. 
And now lock yourself in, so if anything does come, I'm a bit bugger like good. That's just bogus. Come forward, come towards me, I'm now locked in the room. Come and speak to me. Come and scare me, I'm, I'm here, you, can't, you can do what you want now. Throw that duck at me loads of times if you want. Put your head through there like a, like a scary demon. Can you do, can you maybe show yourself there? What the hell was that then? I don't know if I saw something then or if it was just my own eyes, but is anybody there? Can you show yourself to me? Right, well, we have reached the end of our investigations here. We have indeed. It's been a fab Halloween that we've done for you guys. We love doing stuff for you guys, especially Halloween fun things. It's not stopped, has it, Paul? <laughs> no, it's been quite good. You enjoyed it? Oh, yes. I'd uh, quite happily come back here again. Oh, God. And Jane. The Happy pink Halloween, witch. Guys. Yeah, the pink witch. I think that hair suits you, Jane. It does, yeah. Thank you, Sean. It all suits you as well, love. Yeah, and how have you enjoyed it, Jane? I've loved it, and I've actually been in front of the camera tonight. You'll see. Well, that's good. It's good. We did see. We definitely saw what happened, and we hope that everybody at home enjoyed it as much as we enjoyed investigating. It's been an interesting yeah. one. Yeah. And I'm sure there's plenty more to come, but for now, it's going to be good night from us while we get back home, get tucked up and blow our pumpkins out. Happy Halloween, guys!